In this film we're going to look at using peaking on the OM-1 camera. Peaking is when the area in focus changes colour. It's an aid to focusing, especially in manual focus. To switch it on we go to the autofocus menus and then go across to page 6. We highlight manual focus assist and select that. Then we come down to peaking and we make sure we leave that on. Then we go back to page 6 and come down to peaking settings, the second line, and select that. We can change the colour of peaking. I've only ever used red but you have four choices. Go back and choose highlight intensity. You have three choices here, high, normal or low. I've only ever used high. And that's it, you're ready to go. When you manually focus, as you turn the focusing ring, the area in focus changes colour, it goes red. I'm going to leave it focused on top of the rock, but when I let go of the focusing ring, the peaking goes out. And that can be a big disadvantage. If you've got a duck or a goose floating on the water, you can't tell whether it's drifted in or out of focus unless you refocus again. There's a workaround for that. Go to the cogwheel and choose the button settings from the top page. You can change the button settings for stills photography or video. We're going to change it for video. And you can change almost every button on the camera to do something different. I'm going to choose the AEL button right next to the FN lever. And you click on that. You can change that button to do all sorts of things. But I want it to be on peaking. So leave peak active. And you can see it's set up for peaking. Now I have to press the AEL button to activate the peaking. But very importantly, when I let go of the focusing ring, it remains active. It remains in a red colour. So if that Canada goose was to start drifting out of focus, I would be able to tell. You can take the peaking off by pressing the AEL button again, or if the camera goes into sleep mode, it switches off automatically.